So here we have the Volkswagen Touran on an 06 plate. I'm gonna start off by showing you around the outside of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. But from the outside, you can see that it's a five door car. Let's start off inside the boot and then we'll work our way around the rest of it from there. Approach the back of the car, you'll see that we've currently got all seven seats in place. This is how much boot space you have as a seven seater. Let me show what it's like with the two rear ones folded down. And as you can see, you get loads of space when you do that. You can fold down the remaining three seats as well, should you wish to. Okay, so we're just going to work our way back round to the front of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. But now that we've done a full circle of it, you can see that it's in excellent condition the whole way round. Just briefly before we climb in, I think it's where we'll see the interior from this exterior point of view. There's plenty to run through on the dashboard, so let's hop in and we'll do that right now. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. On the left-hand side, we have the rev counter and on the right-hand side, the speedometer. In the middle at the bottom, we have the fuel gauge and coolant temperature gauges. And above that, the total miles for this car, which are 114,709. Just to the left, we have the indicator stalk. And on there, you'll also find controls for the cruise control. Over in the center, you can adjust the temperature for the car on this dial, the fan speed in the middle one, and then the direction you'd like the air to be distributed in over on the right-hand side. You can recirculate the air that's in the car. That's a great way of heating it up or cooling it down quickly, depending on the temperature you set here. We have a rear heated screen over there as well. Below that, we have the stereo system. The main volume for the stereo is just here and the button that will turn it on and off. We have the CD player, as you can see. We then have AM and FM radio, and you can set presets down the left and right hand sides as well. Below that, we have the ashtray or storage area just here a 12 volt charging socket or cigarette lighter. This button will turn off the electronic, electronic stability program for the car, so the traction control, you can turn that on and off from here. We then have a five speed manual gearbox. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to kind of see the car for yourself and have a test drive, please feel free to give us a call here at Glenbournes. We'd love to hear from you soon.